What is up, guys? I'm Zoff. I'm Rob. I'm Brace. And this is Real Time. Today, we're coming back at you with movie night number 67, The Cabin in the Woods. Um, you guys picked horror this week in Cabin in the Woods 1. Um, I'm excited. I've heard about this movie a lot. Uh, I know that, um, well, actually, I just know now that Thor is in it. Chris Hemsworth. Yeah, that's pretty cool because he is just awesome. I can't see him being in this. I'm trying to picture it, but I just think he would destroy all the monsters or whatever. <laughs> I think this was before Thor. Yeah. I don't know what what is the like the enemy in this. Like what is the scary thing? I know that it's probably going to be like some sort of monster. I feel like I, that's my guess. No ghost. I don't think ghost. But no, I've, I've never seen this. Um, I'm looking forward to this. It's a nice short horror movie, so it's going to be pretty good. Yeah, I mean, everyone has let us know. I mean, Rob, Rob's seen it, so he knows, mm-hmm. obviously, but it, th- that this is more so a comedy. It's very comedic for a horror film, which is cool. Um, we have, I don't know if we've watched like a, a super... I don't know if we've actually watched a super scary film yet on the channel. Like, is there any that... Like, some are scary, but I don't think any... Eh. Black Phone, Midsommar, I don't know. Those are pretty strange, freaky. The Strangers. Strangers. There's a couple, but nothing really like when I watched like The Conjuring or something like that. It like really got me like sh- shooketh. But yeah, the only thing I know besides this two is the reference in I think Scary Movie like two or something <laughs> when it was Mac Miller and Snoop Dogg in the woods. And he was like, he kept saying like, the movie about the cabin in the woods. And Snoop Dogg kept saying different movies like, He's like, no, I don't know. You guys probably know what I'm talking about. That's all I know, though. I haven't seen this. And I don't know if I know much of the cast. I I don't, I know Hemsworth. I don't think I've seen anything w- with him in it. I really. don't remember anybody else, honestly. Yeah. But I feel like I might recognize somebody. I don't, you'll never know. But like you said, I've I've seen this movie. I've seen it a good bit of times. I, I really like it. I remember really liking it. It's been a long time since I have seen it. Um, It is like heavily heavily influenced by a bunch of different horror movies and like references a bunch of different classic horror movies i feel like the biggest one is evil dead you guys probably haven't seen that classic i think a new one just came out recently but um yeah there's just so many so many horror references in this movie that it's it's super funny with all that being said, guys, we're going to go right into this video. If you do like our videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Check out our links in the description. we got the Patreon, the Discord, all our social medias, as well as our PO box. Make sure you check all those out. We'll catch you guys for movie night number 67, The Cabin in the Woods. Let's do this. What are we, what's happening? I have no clue. Look at that. I want to drive one of those immediately. <laughs> And if we all raced, I would win. <laughs> I'm getting so pissed, I don't know what this dude in the right's from. Dude, he looks just like a mixture of so many different actors. He reminds me of Matthew Perry from Friends. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But it's not. Matthew Perry mixed with Conan. Are you even listening to me? <laughs> Weirdest intro. Uh, the Cabin in the Woods, bro. Yes. Oh my gosh, what is she from? It looks like Jennifer Lawrence a little bit. I've never seen her before. Oh, what is she in? Oh my god, your hair, it's blonde. Very fabulous. No, I can't believe you did it. But Jerry shot it now. But no, no, it looks awesome. Looks a lot like uh, the receptionist at, on The Office, too. Sorry. Bro, what? Oh, I know him. Yeah. He's in, yeah. uh... Yeah. Grey's Anatomy guy. Jesse Williams. I was gonna say the guy in, um... Personality Split. That's not him. No. No. That's James McAvoy. Oh, my God. <laughs> You knew who that is? <laughs> no, I mean, I just know that character. Like, and he's just smoking weed while driving <laughs> in the car. Like, sipping water or something. <laughs> no. People in this town drive in a very counterintuitive manner. That's what I... 
We'd all like to check out my cousin's country home. Honey, honey, that's not okay. Statistical fact, cops will never pull over a man with the keys. Mm. Hear this man. They know he sees farther than they. And he will bind them. When it's down for the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that thing is. Oh, that is dope. <laughs> dude. What are you cool. stoned? <laughs> you see that thing go down to a coffee mug? Uh huh. He's efficient, bro. He's smart. Identification, please. Mr. Perry, they told me. I'll hold my post, Mr. Hatch. He's a good man. What are they doing? They're like fucking with these people. They're doing something with them. Got people like watching. <laughs> There's always a gas station stop. All these horror movies. I don't think there's gonna be any <laughs> Damn. Dude. Dude, what did he say? I don't even know what he said. <laughs> it was like Merle. So wanted to get directions? Yeah, we're looking for uh, what's it called? Tillerman Road. Do you know if it's this way? Ew, what Ew. the fuck's in his mouth? Tobacco. Takes you up the hill there. Dead ends at the old bucket place. My cousin bought a house up there. You go through like a mountain tunnel, there's a lake, and you left to the bucket place. I feel like I can hear his like accent coming through sometimes. Isn't he like Australian? I think so. Yeah, not the first. I've seen plenty come and go. How my been here? Look, he's. I don't think that's actually tobacco, is it? Oh, it's making me. Feel really yucky how he's doing that. It's probably some just like old fashioned ass fucking tobacco. Other than that war, you sassing me, boy. You were rude to my friend. That whore. Oh. oh. Reminds me of Fallout. This is remind me of Wrong Turn a little bit too. I think Wrong Turn literally does have a uh, like a gas station scene like that. Yeah, it was with an old guy. <laughs> Maybe that's like a reference. This is obviously a Breaking Bad reference, right? Mm hmm. Oh my. Dude. Uh, what? That fucking freaks me out. Oh, oh, it's probably got a camera in it, huh? Maybe. I mean, birds aren't real. You guys know this, right? Oh. Other okay, games? so there is some weird shit going on here. That tunnel has to be like the... They're deadass like in some like black mirror like... room and show type shit. This must be it. That's it? Damn, this thing is long. Yeah, huh? it goes deep. Has he said anything? Not much. <laughs> you ran into the old dude in the gas station and went, Whoa, dude. <laughs> and that's, I think, I think that's it. Take that shit down. Damn. Oh, is it a one-way mirror? Aw, uh, don't be weird, bro. Don't be weird. Dog. <laughs> he said, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> He's coming back, bro. Shout out to him, bro. He could have easily not said anything. A good guy move. Buy this place. We should check the rest of the rooms. Make sure this is the only one. See, don't worry. He wants to watch us pound it away. <laughs> I didn't even like hearing that. <laughs> Feel better if we switch rooms? I really don't. Sweet. Or uh, being decent. At least I could do. 
These curtains, jewels sold you to me for marriage. So they're like kind of setting him up with her. What the fuck are they doing here? I, I, dude, I did not think it would be anything like this. Like just uh -uh. Like watching them. <laughs> it's a very uh, unique movie. Dude, what? Okay, my turn. Jules. Make out. That moose over there. It's not a moose. Have you ever seen a moose before? Whatever that mysterious beast. Why do I feel like the wolf might come alive here, Grace? Uh, I don't know. I think that would just throw everything off the rails. I feel like it'd be subtle shit at first, right? Not a, not a yeah a dead wolf coming alive. <laughs> it'd be crazy though. Maybe it'll like make a little movement. She's like, I swear to I swear to God, it moves. It's so sweet of you to say. I just colored it. <laughs> no, no, no. There's no need to help me. <laughs> That's my girl. I'm about to kiss some freaking wolf, bro. Ugh. Dude, what the fuck? You don't have to do all that. Oh my. <laughs> bro, chill. Make what? it stop. No, fuck no, dude. <laughs> Kick her <Wow>. out. <laughs> Shit. Shit was weird. That's how you get them to do the dare. There. <coughs> what the hell was that? What? It's the cellar door. The wind must have blown. <laughs> 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 you gotta be troll. <laughs> you stay down here? I think the flashlight is not lighting anything up. Yeah, this is like realistic. Sometimes in movies they pull out a flashlight and the whole room lights up. Yeah, she got one out and I, I can't see shit. Uh-uh. I fucking hate dolls. You okay? For help, avoid the dare. Take your top off. <laughs> Jesus. That cellar door is closing. Maybe we should go back upstairs. I dare you all to go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Is he tweaking? Guys. Guys, listen here. <laughs> what was happening? Everyone was like in a trance. Then we will be restored and the great pain will return. And then, then there's something in Latin. Okay. I'm drawing a line in the <laughs> <laughs> Please don't read the Latin. Who's saying that? Super vivo caro. Dolor. Here comes the cellar door closing. Or just fucking raising the dead. That's the dude in the painting. Just waiting in the dirt. There's, there's everyone buried around here is getting up. The girl in the painting. But this is zombie redneck torture families. Mm. <laughs> there's this distinct difference. Oh man, I'm sorry. He had to crunch in his oh, hand. Well, in a couple more minutes, who knows what might have happened. So each one of their things probably we're going to have a different outcome. Yeah.
<laughs> what, what is she, she doing? What is she doing, bro? <laughs> Talk about people and pieces anymore tonight. Oh, are you feeling lonely, Marty? Is that not her boyfriend? Mm -hmm. Busy de-virginizing Zayna. Jules, do you want to go lie down? That's exactly the point. Rush, rush. Stop pushing around. Well, they're possibly dead. They're going outside. Everybody's asking, why is Jules suddenly a celeb you saw? And since when does Kurt pull this alpha male book? They're all acting different. He's on full academic scholarship, and now he's calling his friend gay kid? Kurt's just drunk. I'm seeing Jules, too. Well, then maybe it was something else. Seeing what you don't want to see. Puppeteer, pop tart. You say you have pop tarts. Marty, I love you. You really are. That's who we are. He's onto it. <laughs> I guess it'll have to come off. I am Thor, God of Thunder. Baby, come on. We're all alone. Yeah. Oh, come on. Roll in a second. On it. Engaging pheromone. <laughs> pheromone mists. Jeez. What is that? It's like, wouldn't it like make them all horned up? Yeah, I'm pretty sure pheromones like make you get in the mood. Weird. I don't know about these practices going on right now. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude. They might be dead. Okay, baby, let's see some boobies. Dude. Show us the goods. <laughs> Dude. There it oh. is. They had to keep the customer satisfied. I didn't think we were going to get boobies. We got boobies. Two of them. Oh. What the? No, fuck? sir. Oh! Oh! Oh shit! Ah, he got something in his fucking. Ooh, uh, that was deep. Oh my god! That's gosh. a big man. What the fuck was that? Oh, that's dead. Oh. What is this? It's like, like a, bear it's a, it's a bear trap, yeah. Oh! A chain... chainsaw? It's like a saw. A saw. A handsaw. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Well, they're fucking gone. What kind of sick shit's going on here? What's this? Oh, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Looks like they're like freaking spawning something. Emo man, you gotta wake up. This shit is topsy turvy. <laughs> Just reading a picture book. He's dead. Had the stars. Ugh, dude. You better not just die. Look behind him. I know, I see it. <laughs> Listen. Oh, dude. 
Oh, he just clotheslined that little girl. <laughs> He's still back. He's still alive. Ow. Dead. Fucking dead. Oh my god. Is that her head in his yeah. hand? Yeah. You can leave now. That's insane. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> that dude's huge. Yeah, he's scary. What is that thing? He could bust that door down. All zombies like him. She was missing an arm. That's the girl in the diary. Barricade every window and door. We gotta play it safe. No matter what happens, we have to stay together. <laughs> no. Watch the master work. What's that? What? What's the matter? Uh, this is right. We should split. <laughs> <laughs> We have to split up, of course. Yeah, good idea. Really? The sentiment. <laughs> <laughs> Make him want to split up. Oh my god. What was that? What the? You're not supposed to see something? Uh oh, that's not good. He found a camera. Judah Buckner to the rescue. I hope they get exposed. I want a reality TV show. <laughs> My parents are gonna think I'm such a burnout. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Marty. Oh, the extended bong. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no. Ah. Uh. Sniped him. Marty, my guy. No. We need Marty. What the? Damn, for real? I don't know if I like that. You fucked with Marty? Yeah, dude. <laughs> he uh, was by far the best character. What the fuck was that about? He's dead. Cup runneth over, bro. Are they here? Because they were shaking and the... Oh, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> It's just Dana and what's his name? Holden? Come on. I don't even know. And Chris oh. Hensworth. Oh, yeah. What is that? <laughs> Seems like they want you to go down here. Bear trap. Oh my god. Ah. Oh. Stab him. You like pain? <laughs> oh. You like pain? How's that for you? I mean, he's a zombie, so probably pretty hard to kill, <laughs> right? You like pain? <laughs> I mean, no way he's all right. That's a bear trap to your back. I can't believe Thor's still alive. He needs to summon lightning.
Get away! They're not gonna make oh. it. Oh my god. So now what? The big tunnel. It's right there. Alright, we got any uh, climbing gear, rope. You can't go that way. Oh my god, jump on the bike? It's gonna... Eagle, they're gonna hit that wall. You remember the bird hit it? Yeah. Mm. Coming back with cops and choppers and large fucking guns and those things. Oh, it's so inspirational. He's just gonna hit a fucking wall and fall down and die. Yeah. For jewels. Don't hold back. That'd be so troll. <laughs> He's just gonna freak his body. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> that was so bad. Oh. <laughs> Artie was, right. was right the whole time. Puppeteers. I would not have guessed these two were the last two alive. I would guess her. Maybe her, yeah, but. We're not winning. Okay, no matter what happens, I gotta stick. <laughs> okay, dude. No matter what happens, we gotta stick into the fucking lake. That was a bad way for him to go. Poor man. <laughs> Don't grab her. Uh, uh, nope, he's grabbing her. What a deep ass lady. Oh my god. Bear trap. <laughs> Alive. They got her. She's dead. Dude, he's swinging her around. It's <laughs> just, just an after party. Cooler with a mermaid. <laughs> you know if we get the overtime bonus on this end? Still messing with her back there. Hey, no, seriously, that wasn't our fault. So, so there was a glitch, a power reroute from upstairs. Hmm? Turn the fucking music off. What's going on? It's a mood shift. What if they're like all just alive? Who's the big dogs calling upstairs? I am not doubting you. Which one? Oh, it's. Someone's still alive? Yeah, it's gonna Marty. Be Marty. Marty. I pray to God, bro. How I... is she still alive? She was literally vomiting blood. Marty. Yeah, dude, it's the fucking bomb. Thank God, dude. <laughs> Marty's so alive. I knew that death was too stupid, bro. <laughs> He's got his bong sword. Into the water. Go, go. Okay, I was so confused how the move was still gonna go on after that. So Marty has to stay alive. Doesn't really matter if she does, cause er, no, it, it's only optional if she's the last, last one. Yeah, but Marty has to stay alive. Yeah. Get in there.
and alligators. Somebody sent those dead fucks up here to get us. But there's maintenance overrides in there. I think I can get it to go down. Which yes, so yeah. I have they what if they just start killing everyone? Oh yeah, I think Oh yeah, for sure. All these people are just underneath them. Because yeah. he said a, a power reroute from upstairs. It was just him fucking with that those wires probably. Well he's gonna come they're gonna come down these people. Damn, dude. What the fuck is that? Like a werewolf. It's like a wolf and like a fucking gorilla or something. Now what? Something else. Look, like we're gonna see the merman eventually. That's just a ghost. Lame. Oh, is that the harbinger or whatever? Harbinger? Harbinger? Ah. What the fuck? That dude's creepy as I shit. Know. Chris Hemsworth was playing with that. Yeah. Dude. Mm hmm. What? <laughs> oh, fuck. I wouldn't want to have chose him, bro. He's like, uh, like some Hellraiser shit. Yeah. Oh. Fuck no, dude. Shit's not right. Good transition. Oh, they got him. Ancient ones. We are not in a cabin in the woods anymore. Oh. Purge. Oh. Let them out. They're all going to come out. Oh, look at those doors right there. They're fucked. Oh, shit. oh my god. A tree? Look at a big ass snake. <laughs> Jesus. That oh. <laughs> is an army of nightmares. More. Oh, I need to see him, bro. The ghost. Oh, God. Everything is so fucked. Ooh. This guy didn't even want to be here, bro. What is that intern saying? I don't know. I couldn't read it. Bruh. It's gonna be the guy with razors. Oh my god. Oh, bat. No way, dude. <laughs> Realistically, they got lucky with just the zombies. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Definitely. One more. The Buckner girl. She's gonna save the day.
Ah. Ah, oh, dude. Goodbye to him, bro. That poor guy he didn't want to be there. Truman. These guys better kick the bucket, too. Merman. It's a merman. Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh, that's fucking gross. Ew. How is it just him? Oh, nice. <laughs> He's dead. Are you gonna kill him? I hope not. The ritual like is completed if she kills him though, I'm pretty sure. The necklace he was wearing. Who? The guy who he she uh, just stabbed. Sigourney Weaver. <laughs> I don't know who that is. It's from Alien. Hmm. Different in every culture. It has changed over the years. It has always required you. Get your gun up, girl. If you live to see it, the world will end. Maybe that's the way it should be. Until I afford them. Gosh, they're both so... <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Dana. Shoot her. Yeah. I wouldn't trust this lady, bro. Oh. So am I. He has to die first. Uh -oh, it's not gonna work. Oh. What's coming to kill her? Or is it the girl? Yeah. Who is it? That zombie girl. Oh, yeah. Oh! Axe to the head. Shout out, little Buckner. <laughs> Is the world gonna end now? I want to see it end. I want to see these these ancient gods rise up. It just picks her like Godzilla. <laughs> Under the circumstances. <laughs> Light one up. I'm sorry I let you get attacked by a werewolf and then into the world. <laughs> Giant evil god. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. I know. That would have been a fun weekend. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? The ancient ones are rising. Jeez. Oh my. Well, that's uh, not what I was expecting uh, when I hear the title of the cabin in the woods. That was just a whole like black mirror, uh, just hunger games. So many feels like this was just a hundred movies in one little area it was crazy um i did enjoy it though it was it was good i liked the people i liked marty the most obviously he was 
awesome. He was funny. I'm glad that he survived till the end. And then I think they just died because the world was ending. Yeah, mm. the ancient ones are rising. But that was a crazy freaking way to like the cabin in the woods with all of that. That's insane. Yeah, I'm glad they brought Marty back. I was really sad with how he went out originally. Mm -hmm. And like looking back, they didn't show him off screen death. Yeah, they, didn't, they just showed blood. So mm -hmm. it makes sense. But he was by far the MVP. He did pretty much every important thing like he found that room it's a good spot to look like if he was up they said like because he was smoking he was yeah. he was immune to yeah. their their toxins or yeah. whatever so he could like think clearly and i think that if you do think you're like on some crazy like because he said that i'm on a reality tv show mm -hmm. so if you think that the best place to go is probably the one place you wouldn't think anyone would go which is back in the grave mm -hmm of these zombies and that's where like the control room was so makes sense that that's where they would come from too yeah yeah i, I just i love this movie I, I just think it's so cool how it like switches up at one point and like i just think once they go downstairs into the facility it's just so so cool it's it's literally an entirely different movie at that point i was gonna say it kind of felt like barbarian to me where it was like without saying too much just kind of like switched i don't know mm -hmm. like it had two different feels completely and like Zaf, i thought it was literally just gonna be them in a cabin in the woods yeah and shit was like happening yeah 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 i just like how self-aware it is and like it's obviously making fun of a lot of horror movie tropes like the one of my favorites is chris hemsworth just smell something he's like I think we need to split up. I think yeah. we should split up right yeah. now. Just all the shit like that is so funny. And just Marty being the one who knew the whole time. Like yeah. he's he's the fool. That was his role. He's supposed to be the fool. And he's the one who knew the whole time and figured everything out and pretty much caused the end of the world indirectly. Yeah, I like the the guys in the control room as well. Hilarious. I like both of them just as like comedic actors already mm -hmm. seeing them and stuff and then they were hilarious there like it would like kind of get serious for a second it would just instantly just be hilarious whatever they say but yeah i definitely do get why some people were not happy that this one got chose for horror because it definitely wasn't that scary like at mm -hmm. all and but it was still a good movie but i would really like to watch like a scary scary movie yeah here soon like a real spooky one. Yeah, like I mean, we might just have to tap into like a like a sinister or something that we already watched because they're really the scary ones, but like we've watched them, so but I feel like they would still spook me because I don't remember much about Sinister. If you guys do like our videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, check out our links in the description. We got the Patreon, the Discord, and all of our social medias as well as our PO box. Make sure you check those out and we'll catch you guys next week for movie night number 68. Peace.